Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone, glad to see you again in my channel. Today it's uh, on the weekend. I spend some time to make some Indonesian dessert. By the way, in the market I found this pandan leaf. Pandan leaf is uh, very useful for us Asian people uh, as uh, aromatic for our cuisine as well as the food coloring so if you want to put a green color in the food we usually make a extract pandan leaf after we wash the pandan leaf we then cut into small pieces and then put it in the water mix with this time i put uh, a bunch of pandan leaf with 250 milliliter or 250 cc um, and then uh, i put in the blender and afterward i strain and i keep only the water the extract uh, of pandan is uh, ex pandanus leaf extract as a food coloring of this recipe afterward in a bowl i prepare uh, 50 ml warm water um, one tablespoon sugar and uh, one teaspoon instant yeast and then mix well and wait about five minutes before we use it in the batter Now I uh, mix all the ingredients on the mixing bowl, the one cup of um, rice flour, um, a half cup of um, scone starch or tapioca starch, uh, and then I put the pandanus, pandan leaf extract, I put sugar, uh, salt, um, and then also I put one tablespoon or half tablespoon of baking soda we mix uh, with uh, hand first we mix by hand first we add also some coconut milk uh, about uh, 50 milli or 100 milliliter and then I also add one egg Afterward, I uh, mix everything with using a blender for about 10 minutes. After uh, all the ingredients are uh, being mixed by using the blender, I let it sit for about one hour in order to have um, a lot of bubble in the butter. While waiting for the butter to improve, then I cut the banana into small slices. Mm, 
after waiting for one hour then now the batter is ready then I prepare the frying pan it's a small pan especially for surabi and also I use the temperature of the stove with the lowest one and I put uh, some of the butter maybe about one or uh, two spoon uh, in the uh, pan and then we have to shake a little bit um, the butter in order to have a thin crispy it uh, so like in the video you can see how I do it afterward uh, then we put some slice of banana as a topping then uh, cover uh, the pan with the lid and wait until uh, the srabi will cook when the srabi is already set or well cooked and then you remove it from the pan and put in the surfing tray I still have some chocolate from food stock so I'm using it as a chocolate syrup and I put it as a additional topping on the banana so it's very delicious now the serabi or Indonesian banana cake uh, banana pancake I mean it's ready it's very delicious and you know this one actually I like to have it for breakfast but I also often make this recipe when I invite some friends to come uh, for afternoon tea or anything sometime we get together with some Indonesian friend I have prepared uh, in the morning in advance the butter and then uh, when my guests are coming then I turn off the, the stove, the picnic stove, and also preparing the butters. And everyone can self-service, they can put the, they can put the uh, butter by themselves. They make uh, their own, they can put what they like, they can put banana. I have some other topping like raisin, I have some other nuts, and you can also put some cheese or anything you like so it's it's really you know it's a uh, food uh, comfort food for everyone after the you know banana pancake is done then I make I fry actually I grill uh, this banana with a little bit of butter uh, until it's golden brown actually it's already very good uh, without other topping uh, but I also sometimes to make it more rich I uh, pour it with some cinnamon powder and chocolate syrup as well as uh, sprinkle it with raisin for hot weather this is really a perfect combination with hot tea or with other hot drinks but in a hot weather, in the afternoon or daytime, um, I usually make this combination with the ice cream as well. So actually the, the perfect ice cream can be coconut ice cream or vanilla. 
But this time I don't have the stock, uh, so I put the cheese and strawberry ice cream. I think it's okay too because uh, uh, all my guests will be happy as well. It is really delicious dessert and it's really a very perfect comfort food this season especially like on the weekend all my day uh, on the weekday it was very uh, tiring day so I pamper myself with it I hope you like it I hope you like all this recipe that I made today hope to see you again in my next video don't forget to give your support with your thumb like share and subscribe see you again in my next video assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh